Hi guys, welcome to Naresha Technologies. This is Subhras. In this video session, you guys are getting how to create a project, how to create app, that execution. Of course, in the previous video sessions, I shown project creation inside files, app creation inside files, their purpose. That purpose will execute now today. Let's move inside without any delay. Come on. Right, first command prompt already created one, tree previously executed. So executed that is a reason XML files created in dot idea folder. What is that separate session we will see. Now we will enter into app creation. Django iPhone admin start app and web app. Generally I am creating web application level web app. Yes if you are hitting the return key app created now you are going to tree and tree structure you are giving. App level admin dot py apps dot py models dot py test dot py views dot py. All these are Python related files. How these files we are going to use in Django environment, we will try to observe. Yes, I am opening the same structure here also created through PyCharm. I am opening the right, total structure we can try to observe once app created. This is root level and next level project related files, app related files. So now if you are observing these project related files, these are project related and these are application related. So in this application related file, views.py indicates Python logic, business logic completely we are writing in views. Let us without any delay, we will write the Python logic in the views. Now go to views, right. From Django shortcut import render existed. We need to import some HTTP response related. We will try to import from Django dot HTTP import HTTP response and HTTP redirect also we can use. Right now I am not showing only response I am showing. Okay, good. Now come to function def my first view request and you can say return i am returning http response welcome to welcome to django first project welcome to django first project simply wrote enough that one so this is a business logic just one statement i implemented now I am coming to URLs, this view I need to configure that. Go to URLs and URLs existed here from you need to import from web app and import views. Once you are talking about the views and you can say path, path and URL. Home page I am providing just comma views dot and your written business logic existed with the my first view comma once url is also completed come back to server you can check it python manage.py run server yes perfectly running that or not we need to check it just if you are hitting the return key page not found should come page not found should come yes page not found because our page name is home page just forward slash home you can provide forward slash home you can provide hit the return key perfect displays welcome to django first project go back to your server how nicely it is executing just fav icon error it is giving some migrations also it is not error it is just warning in upcoming projects we will try to resolve all these things step by step so this is the first project you want to apply any html related or style sheet related properties in that views.py yes we can add now we can add that come with me just go to views and i'm adding one tag here h1 i said now i'm adding h1 write simply and try to refresh on your web page it is applying h1 so go back server running or not you can check it yes server running perfectly django welcome to django first project i want to apply some styles yes go back to that 
style style is equal to just color red just refresh that executing or not you can check it go back and server correctly responding or not while server is responding time it takes a few seconds to respond go back to server and you can check it every time server properly running or not then you want to load some more colors like font size you want to write 10 pixels yes go to server every time server reloading reloading time just wait and now you can come back to your page that will work you won't get any kind of uh, server related error now perfectly executing so this is the simple project creation and one app creation executing that with a simple function like this multiple functions multiple urls in the next session i'll try to show you thank you for watching my video sessions for more video sessions subscribe naresh channel